Hi, my name is Michaela and I work for Bodytail Europe here in Germany. And today I'm going to show you how the blood glucose monitoring and diabetes management system Glucotel is set up. Okay, um, this is the, the starter kit and you can open it on the bottom and let's see what's inside. Ah, okay. Everything you need to get started, the glucotel, a carry case, first strips, control solution, a lancing device, what is this, lancets and leaflets. Okay, and something very important, the patient quick start guide. And um, I have prepared something already. If you unfold it, you see that it shows you everything you need to know how the setup is done. Um, but because we have voice and picture here on this video, I'm just showing you how this is done, okay? Um, the first thing we need to do is to download the Bodytel mobile application to a compatible cell phone. Compatible cell phones can be found on our website www.bodytel.com on the left side. Let's have a look. There is a list of all compatible cell phones. This one is on that list and what you shall do now is go to service and downloads and go down here and enter your mobile phone number into that field. Please be aware to um, do it in the international format, so with a plus and then your country code. In my case, for Germany, this is plus four nine. I have already prepared that. And when I now push that button, a text message will be sent to my mobile phone. It will I will receive it in a few seconds. It's a text message that contains um, a link. This one, you should just open that link. And the mobile phone's browser is opening. Do you want to connect to the server? Yes. And now it's asking me for a access point, which is different depending on your uh, mobile phone provider. In my case, this is T-Mobile Internet. So I choose that and the connection is now established. And now you see that uh, we provide the software and the, uh, the access to that software in three different languages. In this case, I go down to English and push the button. Now it brings me to a page where I have to agree on uh, two different things. First, the privacy statement. Yes, I mark it. You should read it first. Um, and then you can just mark also the business terms. And then you go down to the button Send. And this brings you now to the download page where we provide two different versions. One for Sony Ericsson, one for Nokia. Since this is a Nokia, I choose Java version for Nokia. I push the button and this initiates the um, installation process. Download and install Bodytel. Yes, please. Okay. You can now choose if the software shall be saved on the phone's memory or on the um, memory card. Since my memory card has more space left, I choose that, but you can also choose the phone's, the phone's internal memory, it doesn't matter. Now it's downloading the application. It takes a few seconds, but actually it's pretty fast. Okay. So download completed, now it's all automatically installing it. Installation complete, woo, okay. We can now just close the phone's browser and close the text message fields, just go back, go back. 
before you now start the software Bodytel Mobile, you should be aware of something important. It's also written down in the quick start guide in that blue box. Um, the phone has certain um, options, for example, is the software allowed to read and write user data? Uh, if we don't do what I'm going to do now, it would ask you every time. So that's why we go to the application manager. In every phone this can be in a different place, so you should look uh, in your phone's uh, manual where this is hidden. <laughs> in this case it was pretty easy in systems and application manager. We go to Bodytel because we want to change the settings for Bodytel. We open it and there are a few things we need to adjust. The first point is not on every phone but on my phone. I can now choose the access point here. As I told you my provider is T-Mobile so this is already correct. Network access is now at ask first time. We can set that already at always allowed. Something else is important, the connectivity. We also say always allowed. And two other points, read user data is now on ask every time. We always put that to always allowed. You can just um, confirm the security warnings. This is not something uh, important. Edit user data, we also set that to always allowed and that's it. Now we can just go back. The settings are changed and we can now start our application for the first time. This is done. You go in the phone's um, menu, go to applications. In my case it's called applications. can be my own on other phones also. Scroll down and there you find Bodytel. And now I'm going to open it. takes a few seconds and then it welcomes you with our nice um, wizard and this wizard is actually everything you need to know because it takes you step by step to the, through the whole um, installation process. Let's see what we have here. Um, you could now push the button support, then somebody from our company would call you and guide you through the installation, but actually um, this is not really necessary. I show you how easy it is. I just say next and it says the wizard will guide me through the installation. Okay, next. Now it says I shall pair my Glucotel via Bluetooth with this phone. Of course, therefore I need the Glucotel. So let me get it. <laughs> 